Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is December 1st, but it's also Wednesday, so let's watch you working on Wednesday. So I got a new Amigurumi project started. I started it yesterday, and it's living in my Grinch bag. <laughs> I got this a while ago. Um, what year did I get this in? Gosh, 2019 maybe? Maybe even before that. <laughs> but uh, I love this bag, it's so cute. Anyways, I'll have anything to do with the Grinch. So. Here's the color that I'm working with. Can y'all guess what it is? <laughs> I think this is a whole skein that was wound up. This was gifted to me at some point. I can't remember when or who, <laughs> but it's like a whole skein of a green yarn wound into a ball. And I think it's a red heart, but it's not spring green. It's darker than spring green. But uh, I've had this for a while and I wanted to start using it up. So my new whip this week is a Grinch and a Groovy. Um, I don't think it's called Grinch though. It's a copyright. I can't remember now what it is called. I just printed off the instructions. I didn't print off like the whole page. But it's a free pattern by Little Crochet Farm. And uh, Grand Crafter Edna has made some of these recently. And then I was actually emailed. I already had it downloaded and ready to go. And someone emailed it to me to share it with me. And I thought that was funny. So I, I thought I should start it. So I did start it yesterday while watching Harry Potter. <laughs> and this is what I got so far. So I got his little body. He has a tail down here, so I can sew up that hole right there. <laughs> That's always in the middle right there. But uh, so far, there's no sewing. Um, the arms are made separate, and so are the legs, but you sew, you crochet them all together. So that's nice. So I, I'm, I gotta do his head. <laughs> and then I gotta, I'm gonna stitch on his face and stuff. And he has a little scarf as well. So I guess if you wanted to tack this scarf down so it doesn't fall off, uh, you would have to sew that on. But yeah, so he's so cute. They also have a, um, a reindeer, an elf, and a Santa that's the same like shape um, as this little guy. So I think it's cute. I believe the pattern calls for a smaller thread. I think it calls for um, DK weight and a smaller hook. But I'm using worsted weight as per usual <laughs> and an elf hook. So mine might be coming out bigger than the pattern is supposed to be. But also I do crochet tight. So who knows? <laughs> but uh, that's my little Grinch so far. Like I said, it is a free pattern. There's a video tutorial on YouTube for it. I, I think it's broken up into two or three videos. And there's also a free written version, which is what I prefer. I printed it out because I'm pretty sure I'm going to make more of these. Because I love the Grinch. So I am working on his uh, head. I just got to where, um, the you know, where I would, I'm going to start um, making his head. <laughs> Increasing for his head is what I'm trying to say. Uh, so he should be done. Maybe I can finish him up today. I don't know. Depends on if I sit down and crochet. I gotta do some laundry and some dishes and stuff. And uh, sewing later today. But I shouldn't have to sew very much at all because I sewed some yesterday. But yes, that's what I'm working on this Wednesday. So let me know down below in the comments what you guys are working on. And if you're starting any um, crochet, crochet, Christmas related little things. He'll probably be up here somewhere when he gets done. Just a little decoration in the background. It's only 24 days until Christmas now. I got to move my little wreath over now so i'm excited about that <laughs> but uh yeah so i'm also vlogging today for vlogmas and but that will come out later today so you'll see this video first and uh, you can check out vlogmas later tonight if you are interested <laughs> but um today's probably gonna be a boring day but oh well <laughs> uh can't always have like cool fun days but uh yeah so let's see here what did I already say? <laughs> Let me know if you're working on anything. Let me know what you're working on. Feel free to share uh, any designers or pattern names or YouTube channels. Any of that kind of stuff down below. Because we all like to check it out. And uh, yeah. Let me know if you made any of these little guys. I know Granny Crafter Edna has made a few. I feel like someone else made one. I can't remember now who. <laughs> but I'm going to hop off here and get my dishwasher started. Because it's loud as heck. And my, my laundry just finished. So I got to pull it out of the dryer and hang it up. And then I'm probably going to sit down and watch some YouTube videos. Ooh, baby's kicking. <laughs> she just kicked me in the ribs. Um, and what was I saying? I got sidetracked. Watching videos, catching up on people's videos, and finish up this little Grinch. And work on some squares because I'm trying so hard to finish my um, Christmas blanket and my moving stitch blanket. My Christmas blanket I worked on this morning, so I guess I'm also working on that today. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, also baby related. I'm 30 weeks today, so that means uh, around 10 weeks give or take a few is all that's left so it's coming up and it's getting crazy i ordered a bunch of diapers this morning on amazon from my diaper fund that people um gifted me on my registry i'll link that down below if you're interested but there's no pressure um so i had some money on there and i've been watching the diapers 
for uh, prices, you know, to be good. So I ordered some today for um, to stock up because <laughs> we've been stocking up on diapers and wipes. And um, I just want to make sure we have plenty of stuff when she's born so we don't have to leave the house too much because it's going to be winter when she's born. And, uh, you know, I don't want to take her out any more than necessary. We got to get some shots soon. We got to get the Tdap, I think it is. It's for the whooping cough. So I know me and Devin needs to get it, but I don't know if Jesse can get it. I'll have to ask. If he, if she gets sick from anybody, it'll be him because he's in public school now. Um, but yeah, so I just want to make sure we don't make her sick. <laughs> but she's going to definitely just stay home until doctor appointments. And I know at the, in the first part of their life, they go to a lot of doctor appointments. But um, it'll just be home, car, doctor, car, home <laughs> for her until she gets old enough to one, get vaccinated, and two, um, you know, have an immune system, because <laughs> she's going to be so little and fragile. But anyways, I'm blabbing. Uh, let me know what you guys are working on, and uh, check me out later in Vlogmas. I'm going to try to do every day, but I make no promises, because I'm getting more and more pregnant every single day, and it's getting harder for me to breathe, because all my organs are getting smushed up, and, <laughs> and also, um, there's a really good chance I might go into labor early, and it was just a little scary, <laughs> but, um, you know, it is what it is. She'll come when she comes, and, uh, I'm just hoping that it's when she's healthy enough to be, you know, coming out <laughs> without having to stay in the hospital forever, but, yeah, so I gotta get a hospital bag packed up soon. They told me to do it around 20, 32 weeks, uh, just in case, so I need to get that done. <laughs> that's coming up. That's, like, in two weeks. My next appointment is next Tuesday the 7th which is the anniversary of Pearl Harbor I'm pretty sure but uh yeah so it's gonna be a boring appointment there's no, not gonna be any ultrasounds or anything my next ultrasound will be the week of Christmas so I'm looking forward to that but yeah and you see now I'm blabbing <laughs> y'all get me going and I just go <laughs> but uh anyways uh if you want to see more blabbing Ella check out my vlog that will be later tonight because I'm sure I will be blogging blo blogging blabbing <laughs> in it as one does but I'm going to hop off here and get this house stuff going. And then I'm going to sit on my butt and crochet and watch videos for the rest of the day. I'm pretty sure. Until later today, I'll do some sewing. But I, I always, I've been saving my sewing for the evening. Um, after Jesse gets off school, when he's in play mode, before we have to do homework and bath and all that. Uh, so he can play and do whatever he wants to do. I get sew for like an hour. And then it's time to, you know, buckle down and get his homework done. And get him in the bathtub and all that stuff, you know, read stories and all that. We got a whole bunch of new books. See, I'm doing it again. I'm doing it again. <laughs> I'll share that in the vlog. We got a, him a bunch of new books through Scholastic and, um, it took forever and a day to come. We ordered them at the end of September and they just came yesterday. But anyways, I'm going to go before it becomes a vlog. <laughs> I will see you guys in another crochet related video soon and in a vlog tonight. So yeah, I'm leaving now because I'm just going to keep talking. <laughs> Bye guys.